Welcome back to the channel, everyone. How's everybody been? We are back with some more Witcher 3. We're carrying off exactly where we left off as per usual. Gran! Gran! Bumblebee bit Yagner in the arse! Gran! Come! Don't be afraid. I don't know nothing. I won't hurt you. Where's Gran? She's busy. Why why are you afraid exactly? Why are you scared to talk? I'm not scared of nothing. You're all scared of something. Would have told me about Johnny otherwise. I'm worried about Johnny. He don't come round no more. Once when we was mushroom picking. I saw his burrow, but Gran yelled at me, said not to talk to strangers, cause then kids go missing. She worries about Johnny too, though she says he's made up. Okay, where's Johnny? I just want to talk to Johnny. He could know more than you. Not gonna hurt him, right? Cause he's real. He's not made up. I'm not gonna hurt him. Not unless he needs to be hurt. Because Gran liked listening to his songs. When we was picking mushrooms, Johnny said he saw a girl with ashen hair in the swamp. Where can I find Johnny? There is a little meadow on the edge of the swamp. This strange tree grows there. Look around. You'll see him. Thank you. Perfect. We know what to do now. What are you up to there? Footprint. Johnny's been through here. Johnny, Johnny. Where's he off to? Who is Johnny? I reckon Johnny is going to be some sort of monster. Tracks lead to a burrow. Wonder what's inside. How do I lure him out? I'll call him. Don't be afraid. Interesting. You're a bucker? A Luton? Ah, a godling. Not many of you left. I'm looking for a woman with ashen hair. Seen her? Tell me everything from the start. 
Where did you see her? What was she doing? It's important to me. Why not? Can't talk. You know, for the kids from the clearing, well, you know what goes around here? You're gonna know what goes on around here now. Nah. You know the kids from the clearing well? Mm. Don't be afraid. Not gonna hurt anyone. What's wrong? Can't talk? Can talk. Why? The old lady, I reckon. Lost your voice? Kind of. Maybe can he I can't speak. He can only sing. I've got heard he can sing. You want me to follow you? Want me to follow you? Yeah, fine. No choice, I guess. <laughs> Maybe we were too close to that area. And it would have been heard. I don't know. You're going straight towards these monsters, Johnny. I meditate. Nice. Sorry, Johnny. You're gonna have to wait an hour. <laughs> I, just, I need some help. Johnny didn't even realize. It says stay close to me, but he has to lead, so like he can't really say that close. Where are we going? Place? Let me look around. Up there. Oh. Something's on the ledge. Something that'll get you your voice back. He wants some food, I reckon. It's gonna be an egg and I gotta get it for him, but I gotta kill whatever's protecting the egg. Oh, there's multiple. Let's go. Burning. One of them was burning. Oh, I might have caught one with the. This uh... bottle. Maybe. Who knows what the kid wants? Oh, there's eggs. Oh no, these are mushrooms. Let's go talk to Johnny Johnny. Here. He wanted a drink. Whiskey, slither, ringworm, rubbish, bumblebee, flabbergasted. <laughs> the sound of it. Peter Piper picked Prince Proximo a pack of pickle peppers by the Right, his voice was in that. <laughs> Done celebrating. My favorite words. Life without savoring the sound of surreptitious shenanigans is like licking snails through a cloth. Thank you for this, noble whoever you are. Long be your life. Hang on a minute. I helped you, now you help me. Would you turn this Beautiful act of altruism into a banal bartering of favors. Yes. I'm 
looking for a young, ashen-haired woman. See anyone like that? Did I ever? Remember it as if it were yesterday. Soon as I woke, I went to empty my bowels. My favorite part of the day. Defecating to the sunrise. Downright glorious. Suddenly, heard a bang. So loud, it couldn't have been me. And that lass appeared. Out of nowhere. Young, ashen-haired. Just like you said. Wounded and panting to boot. She raced off towards the children's huts. Quick as if the crones were after her. I yelled some unpleasantries. She disturbed my morn. Sadly, I'd lost my voice. So I don't think she heard me. The woman from the village. I've been to the village in the swamp. Met a woman who might have been a crone. Did she seem confused to you? Nuts. Completely. Oof. So I'm not crazy. That's no crone. That's the granny who takes care of the orphans. Claims the kids made me up. Me. An orphanage in a swamp? What do you have against swamps? Lived here my whole life, and I heartily recommend it. <sighs> know anything about the crones? What do you know about the crones? They're as old as this forest. Cruel. Vindictive. Not to be crossed. What if someone does cross them? Might take his voice, might take his life. Depends on their whim. They're nasty. Although, they care for this land and its folk in their own way. Supposedly, they always keep their word. But you must be careful what you ask for. Won't find them until they want to be found. See them until they want to be seen. But remember, they see and hear all that happens in the mire. She ran off toward the orphanage. Kids could know something, or the old woman who takes care of them. No, oh, that old hag don't speak to strangers, and you're a stranger. Will she talk to you? I have spoken to her, got my ways. So be it. You helped me, and I'm no bore. Come with me. Perfect. Come on. You have to speed up a bit, Johnny. We're going to... Gonna go ahead a little bit, maybe see if there's anything in here. This one's got no clue what's going on. Brain of the Drowned. Nice. Oh, I don't say I've got to wait and like, be close by. That's so toxic. I'm guessing that's the way I was supposed to go. Oh, I went there slightly faster than Mr. Johnny Johnny just put down. Can he just walk a little bit quicker? I keep stopping to let him go forward, but he, he's like ever so slightly behind. I suppose he's only small. He's got little legs. It's clear, not a crone in sight. I need to sing to Gran. That ought to calm her. Little Johnny softly gazing, fire waning pale. Pop a spark jumped out and whispered, Listen, I'm a tale. You got your voice back. I did, though I seem to have lost an octave somewhere in the process. I shall look for it when I get home. 
You're not allowed here, Johnny. You shouldn't have come. Calm down, Gran. Don't get angry. It's not good for you. Limits the crones. Ah, let's just talk to the crones first. Crones. Forgive me, Gran, but this fellow absolutely must talk to the ladies. No, she's not allowed. Please, it's important. The fellow will be quiet. Gran, please hear me out. I found little Yagna when she got lost, did I not? Did I break Jenny's fever too? I did. I ask anything in return? No. Didn't even fuss about my stolen voice. Well, now I want something. Gran, help this fellow. Because otherwise, he'll pester me day and night, even during potty time. His lass is missing. Perhaps the ladies can help find her, eh? Well, since you put it that way, Johnny, I'll help him. Come with me. Let's go. Johnny's a good, good lad. Though the ladies don't like him. No. Foul creature, they say. Don't like him. Who are the women in the tapestry? Those are the ladies. Ladies lovely. With power over all. Beseech I thee. Answer. My call before you, a worm crawls, wretched and small. Channel, channel through her, maybe I'm guessing. How dare you disturb our rest, woman? No, I want to talk to you. I'm looking for the woman with ashen hair. I know you met her. Where is she? Oh, he's impatient. Wow, she really likes ashen hair, girl. It's clear you met her. Tell me everything. That was blunt. Well, perhaps it's for the best. Tell me. Have you got bollocks? Do you fear woodland beasts? Oh, Top how tired is that upon this white-haired one? Brother has turned against brother. The land is soaked in blood. Evil reigns stronger than ever before. A dark power has surfaced near Down Warren. It feeds on hatred and disdain. Destroy the beast, and we will be grateful. Tell you all we know about this ashen haired maid. Dark power? You need a knight errant, or a witch hunter, not a witcher. The alderman of Down Warren will tell you all. Remember to collect payment from him after you complete your task. And now our servant will bring you the dagger. Fine, deal. I'll talk to the alderman, but I can't promise anything. Move, woman! Give the young man the dagger. And you, white one, return only once you've completed the task. All of this information just to find out which way Siri was headed, basically. On me way, dagger. Gotta bring the dagger. The dagger for you. Ladies told me to give it to you. Here it is. They did. The dagger. Thank you. Place the alderman's payment on the stone. Stone bear, stone shear, stone nose, stone. Okay. Let's 
Tell what is going on down here? One of those books says Witcher. We're gonna read that book quick. Oh, I've already read this. All right. Okay. Maybe I've already read the Witcher book, maybe. Probably. Fine. Do we need to teleport? Yes. Handy indeed. village boy a real pearl of the swamps if you say so you get by all right boy winter to winter somehow we survive recognize this dagger i master i didn't know you belonged to them uh it doesn't belong to any i don't belong to anyone yeah well i don't belong to anyone down to business. I want to get this done quickly. Ah, so that's how it's to be. I'm supposed to help solve your problem. Tell me what it is. Just the essentials. The war awoke an ancient power. An evil one that feeds on bloodshed. Nightmares haunt our nights and days. Folks sleepwalk from their homes, never to return. Under the tree on the Whispering Hillock they lie. Unburied all. Fathers, sons, daughters, and mothers. Folk are afeard to move them. You must go there. The dark powers must be cast off. I'll take a look around. Ladies of the wood don't know what this power is. They know all. Old Thecla claimed they'd be punishing us. Folk stop respecting them. Some even call them witches. But must not be they. For they sent you. I'll look around the Whispering Hillock. You be careful, Master Witcher. Don't you treat this evil light. So I've gone here to here to back down to here. Okay. We could just get out of here. Nice. Now, it would be nice to just. Come on now. Who are you? A place 
place of power. I don't know, is this working or not? Nothing can protect you now. Why have you come? Why spill this blood? Are you here to grant me death? Or is my freedom your wish? Grant you death, maybe. You claim I can free you. Why was I attacked? Who are you? Let's go with who are you. Who are you? I abandoned my circle. Where I kept the balance. The crones killed me. And cursed my ghost. Never heard of a druid circling Velen. I wander eternally through a maze of vows. Helplessly sliding or rusty. Valence curse. They hear all through severed ears. They weave hair and twist lives. They take their strength from the broth of human flesh. Why did they kill you? The crones want this land. They drew the wood alone. I stood in their way. I had to die. You claim I can free you. You claim to be imprisoned. How so? I am bound here in fetters of magic. I wandered endlessly. A labyrinth of thieves. The children. I know all. I know what awaits them. Free me, please. I must help. If something threatens the orphans, I'll help them myself. The children have been taken. Free me, please. I can be a gear. A gallop unchained. I shall see them. Only I can. I don't know what to do. I don't think this over. I don't believe you. I'll help you. I'm not sure what to do, to be honest with you. Uh, let's say I don't believe you. Oh, I pressed the wrong button. You must come back. Free me. I beg you. Beware my sentries. They stand guard still. I'm back. I've been waiting. You've returned. Your decision. I long to be free once more. At Ard Serbin, death looms for the orphans. Free me, I beg you. I can't help them. Uh, I, I, I don't believe you, let's just say that. I didn't say I wouldn't help, I just needed proof.
diamond dust. Solved your problem. Just in case, though, avoid the whispering hillock for a while. Cannot be. Where's something lurking there? A spirit possessed a tree. Destroyed something. Not sure what. You don't want to know. I, yeah, let's say that. Not sure what was lurking there, but it lurks no more. What did you do, Witcher? Some being had come to possess the tree's heart. I destroyed the heart and its inhabitant. So it were a ghost. Will it be back? No. The crones, or the ladies of the wood as you call them, said to remind you about payment. Take it you know what they want? Aye, I do. Give me the dagger. Be back soon. There's payment. Take it to the ladies, will you? What the hell was that? It is our pact. Ah, you're a stranger. You don't know life here. It's honest pay for their protection. So, all those ears in the woods. Put it out your mind, master. You soon be leaving, and we must tarry on. Our young'uns and their young'uns after them. No gods nor masters watch over Velen. The land is no man's. He who wants to survive must seek his own protectors. Cut his ear off. Never seek to cross us again. I'll fight them if they need to be fought. We shall forgive you this transgression for you've done well. Your children are plump as piglets, sweet as caramel. But now we must talk to our white-haired friend. I know that, Mark. This is Anna, the wife of the Baron of Crow's Perch. She belongs to no man. A fruit ripened in her womb. A fruit sprouted from seeds sown by a man she detested. We helped her. She agreed to serve. She bears the mark. She is ours. Come. It is another woman who interests you. Speak, white-haired one. It is. Um, you used me. Why do you look so different now? No, we wanna we wanna just our deal. I did my part, now you do yours. A word once given. So I might have to come and fight these if the Baron wants me to. The girl. I'll fight them. They need fighting, it looks like. That's what they call it. Thin as a rail, terrifying as a 
terrified, exhausted. She could barely stun the poor thing. We cared for her as best we could. Like she was our own daughter. Wasted affection. She proved a very naughty girl. Mischievous, stubborn, and selfish. Where is she now? Don't believe you. They say you always keep your word. So tell me everything, exactly as it happened. We shall tell you, brave boy. Thought I pressed number one, but I'm actually pressed two. Okay, I'm going to end it here. I'm going to say thanks everyone for watching. If you enjoyed today's content, then please do consider liking and subscribing. It does help out the channel quite a lot. And hopefully I'll catch everyone in another stream or video sometime soon. Ah, uh, peace.